both folksy and country and a bunch of other things. This world was very much... I wanted to make sure with all my shows that they live in their own worlds. You know, you can't take a song from Honeymoon in Vegas and put it into 13. Or, you know, you can't take a song from 13 and put it into the last five years. So this world, how do I make this world its own? And so the Midwest, you know, the farm belt in 1965, it, it, there is a specific sound that already attaches itself to that. And so I wanted to honor that and I wanted to honor that Francesca comes from Naples and, you know, post-war and what does that sound like and what does that all feel like? So we were exploring all of those languages that these characters speak. What I found was the most important thing was that I didn't write most of the show on the piano. I wrote most of it on guitar, which I don't play. But uh, I, I picked it up just to sort of say what happens if I, this, what, what, what voice comes out of this instrument. And so it's a, a very guitar heavy show, which is unlike any of the other uh, pieces. The last five years has a lot of guitar in it, but not the same way this does. Uh, and so that was that was my key into the voice was to find a different instrument to write from. And so once I found the guitar, I was like, oh, there it is. Adapting a lot is—is is this something you a way you prefer to work, or it doesn't matter? I think stories are stories, and you know, a story is going to get told because you know how to make it sing. So sometimes I will create those stories, and sometimes other people will, and sometimes it's history, and sometimes it's a, a novel or a film in it. I, I, I'm only concerned about whether I can make it sing and make it sing well whether I can make good music, whether that world is a world I want to live in for the four years it's going to take to write a show or the 10 years it's going to take to write, you know, whatever that is. You know, for better or for worse, all of these things have been gestating for a very long time. Honeymoon in Vegas, I started in 2003. This show we started in 2009 or 2010, something like that. Uh, in the last five years, obviously, I started back in 2000. And so everything just takes its own time. I actually haven't had any time to write anything lately because I've been taking care of these shows that you know have been building for a long, long time. And I'm just now able to start thinking about what do I do next. But finding time to focus is sort of impossible. But these are not the worst problems I could have. You know, I'm so busy I don't have time to you know to focus. Oh well. But uh, it's it's been a lot. But it's I want people to hear this stuff so much. I've been working on it for a long time, and I love it. And I just I can't wait for it to get out there. Don't you know it ain't easy. This is a long road.